the sidelight on the Battle of the Atlantic. In fair weather or foul, the ships of our Navy have to be refueled. On this particular day, the weather was loud. Well, whatever the Navy calls it. An oil tanker has met us well out in the Atlantic. A line is shot to the tanker and a tow line is hoisted aboard. When the two ships are in tow, the oil pipe is hauled across. The pipe is coupled up and the pumps set in motion. Soon another of His Majesty's ships will be on its way with scarcely a pause in its stride. A camera hop to a British port gets us there in time to witness the arrival and unloading of just one more ship bringing yet more lease and lend material from the USA. The ship is hardly tied up before RAF personnel are aboard slinging the big American aircraft ashore to take their part in crushing the blood-sodden beast of Baptist Garden. Well, the more the sooner. Mr. Churchill sponsored the introduction of the tank into modern warfare, so one can understand his interest in their development. The Prime Minister inspects newer types of tanks and armoured cars from Canada and the USA. With the homemade product, they'll help to end the war. And again, the more, the sooner. <laughs>